Welcome back everyone, my name is Dr. Kriva, this is some more European Rosales 4 playing as Aragon in the Rights of Man expansion. And we just went to war with France. Well, actually we're not technically at war with France yet. Now we are. France decided to join the war. Join the war. Join Clemson in the war against Aragon. Does mean that great powers are allowed to join in. Because Austria, England, and Aragon are one side versus France on the other. So there is a chance that the Ottomans, or the Polish, or the Russians, or even Persia. Persia is a great power. Um, they, they might join in, if they so desire to do so. But um, yeah, let's um, crap on these people first, basically. Uh, we do have some force limits, so I'm going to get a couple of mercenaries. I'll go over the force limit just to get a few of these sieges done really quickly. Um, the war goal is good dames as well, so... This is basically what we're doing. Just get some sieges done while we let Austria <laughs> basically rampage over there, you know. Let them have all the fun. I mean, we're doubling their numbers right now. So, I'm not worried about it at all. This, this is mostly a formality war, I suppose. Oh, okay, you were forced back. Um, protect trade in Genoa. Should be fine. Yeah, there will be more money flowing towards Genoa. And if we can, since we are the war leader, we're going to give cores back to Provence. And that should also be the least um, costly. Austria has already embraced global trade. And we have Tagur, Gafsak, and Dames. So the war goal is already ours. And uh, no. In that case, just huddle up, I guess. I mean, what are your military attack is 14. You took defensive ideas. Okay, I'll give you that. But he's still um, attack level behind on military. Um, oh, foreign trade competition rise. So trade was heavily regulated during this era, but despite this, the markets were not fixed. At times, merchants would try to enter new markets or sell new goods. Merchants facing these conditions would usually demand new or higher tariffs to stop their competitors. So we could gain three mercantilism and the burgers gain loyalty. We could deny the tariff and get some diplo power, or use this opportunity to further tax foreign traders. Um, yeah. Let's gain four mercantilism. So currently our income on trade is 45.8. Our admiral's dead. Uh, that sucks. You, I hope you're still protecting trade in Genoa. Wow, our trade power in Genoa has severely diminished recently. It's because they are repairing. That is fine. Yeah, that is okay. Um, the mercantilism, so 45.8, 47.9, that is a noticeable increase, actually. Oh, Clemson's army is on the move. Let's get these guys back behind our main army, of course. Just, just to be sure that they don't kill the one stack. You know, just keep them safe. France is getting some wrecking done. Okay, I need do need another general, so three, two, one, zero. Not that great, but we're gonna put in a siege on that area. You can go there and then go here. Try and get this fleet and then go back to help the Well, the siege there by blockading. Look at that fleet just disappearing. Yeah, that's math for you. There's something wrong with that math right now. It's actually, 13? No. Um, I was about to say something, but I knew it wasn't right. Minus 7%. So they do have a good fort here. Yeah, would need five, 5 extra artillery for that one. That's a mostly artillery heavy army there. That's a very, f well, frontline heavy army. 
I'm gonna put you in Roussillon so they don't decide to attack me instead. See, there they come. 15,000 though, hang on, hang on. Oh yeah, Cahor is sieging that back. Um, we don't have any flanks ourselves, but... Uh, you know what? Let's swap these two around. See what happens. Because this guy doesn't have the siege bar. Oh, they're now doing a double stack on that. That's being sieged back freely. Um, okay. Defenders desert. And here as well. So they just sieged that down and did not really gain anything from it. Okay, I don't like this though. Paris has already fallen, by the way. Just, yeah, they're coming in. That will be a defense for us, but at least this is farmlands. Hello there, France. Came to crash in on me. Ooh, you just lost half your... Oh, wow. That second guy came in like a wrecking ball. We're actually gonna lose the fight. Um, the... Jesus. Well, we did do a lot of losses to them. We actually lost more. So the French are still quite strong. Yeah. Well, we do have our better general over here in uh, Tlemcen, but... Water shortage? Oh, man. How do you start with 0% on that siege? Can someone explain that to me? Oh, because you brought so many... You brought a shit ton of cannons, that is true. You already breached the walls as well. Of course you do. It would be a shame if that one fell already, though. They do have... They're mostly cannons, so that's just frontline, really. I'm, I'm jumping in there, now that it's still a defense as well. They do have a lot of cannons, but... No, 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 no. Oh, good roll for us. Better roll for us. Austria's relieving us. Oh, thank God for that. Thank God they decided to jump in there. And yeah, we're losing... We're gonna lose some manpower in this war, for sure. I'm, I'm focusing on Tlemcen first, obviously. Because this is where the brunt of our... Um, well, because that is the main target of the war. Yeah, sorry buddy, my armies are nowhere near recovered enough to help you there. Then again, this looks good. Yeah. Uh, just, just keep France in check all the time. It's much more fun that way. Britain's still losing its war over here. We're still only at 56% down there. Freaking Clemson. There we go. Hotna Falls. I think I can take that fight. Cannot be entirely sure. But we are ahead of tech. We have... Yeah, they're actually running away already. In that case, I um, will follow. And this guy's getting split up a couple times. Yeah, they're running. They're running far and wide. No, 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 oh, they're, oh, that fort is blocking my movement. You cheeky bastard. You knew that, didn't you? Uh, my armies are nearly fully recovered, though. You can go back into the siege. Tittery, Mitija. Yeah, I can get there be by crossing through Castile into Amara Morocco. That's probably not the way I want to go with these guys. Then again, I could just put them on a ship, let them go around. Oh man, that's bad. Um, I can get out though. Get the hell out. Epic art produced, 10 free prestige. Our bond will fall. Yeah, how are the numbers looking? Quite bad actually. France has lost a lot again. 
They do have a fleet still. Um, Revolt, Mantua, and Pretender Rebels. Oh no, if we're lucky, they will... Why would you run through... That makes no sense whatsoever. Noble Birth. Um, many of the families of the nobility won their current position due to the actions of a forefather who served the state in times of war. For most of their sons, a life in the field is therefore the only imaginable career. With the modernization of the army, however, common officers are no longer entirely unusual. Members of the nobility have now approached us asking that we guarantee what they feel is the right of their class. Ah, so they lose loyalty, the burghers gain the loyalty. My influence also lost on the nobility. Um, then, yeah, no, I will actually, cannot promise. Simply because our, they're already too high on that anyway. We want the Siege of Narbonne. If you can get there, that would be perfectly fine, actually. Castile Rex. Their army is just that much stronger, apparently. Um, Ragusa. They would still do it. They would still... The alliance cannot be offered right now. How are you feeling? 94. Um, let's... Guarantee them. It's a bonus of 10. 10 relations, again. Uh, yeah, let's let's start moving outwards again. I mean, we, we asked them to come in on favors, so... This would be the time to declare Milan for Genoa, by the way, because Austria cannot join the war against us. Yeah, sure, you can have access. I think this is just simply, yeah, the blockade is not helpful. Oh, hang on. Yeah, no, 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 that's fine. Crushed that ship. Cahor falls. Where's Rack? Let's get the Provence. Hmm, Hungarians fighting in Milan against French people. Because it happens in this game. How much longer do we have? We have about eight years. They keep bloody... No. We're using seven in... Huh. Anyway, we're calm, which is stability cost. Okay. Entrepreneur, navigator, and bold fighter. Not bad. He's the shit as 113. Oh, you're trying to escape now. It's a level 5 fort, so I can't really move my army. Sweet. No. It's hiding. <laughs> um, Funch has internal conflicts. 10 peasants. I will. Uh, Damn it. You're going down to Urgell then. Peasant revolt for crying out loud in the middle of a frickin' war. And, wow, I was just thinking about maybe, no, I'm not gonna abdicate my, or disinherit, and then, he's just, he just turned 15, by the way. Wow. Ten peasants will rise up right about now. Oh, hello, peasants. I didn't really see you there. Genoa has gotten global trade. Of course, Genoa does. And we can take Copper Bottoms. We're still on the unbalanced tech issue, so... Also, we're now gaining one extra point of diplomatic stuff. No, six? How? That should have been higher. Okay, let's actually look around and shop for some marriages. Like the Austrians. We do not get ourselves a free consort. Let's get one with Siege of Provence has been won. Swap it over to Provence, of course. Let's marry England. They all have high trust, like 95 now with them. Oh, I wouldn't mind having Jane in charge for a while. Jane Tudor. Jane Mortimer. Actually, they lost her tutors. Oh, no. Oh, no. I just... Wow, that's interesting. Huh. 
more that so now my because they are currently in a re queen regency themselves we get the um the dynasty of the queen regency for our consort now the mortimers are doing something very well apparently bloody hell um why don't you go to because why you have to run away all that way jesus but the city falls. Um, now you can actually run the other way around again. Let's get the full siege on Tlemcen going. Um, yes, Ferrara. Venice is still single. They are at war though. Oh right, they, they revolted at one point. But it is a Ferraran claim now. We need to get some more Diplo reps soonish. Leoness falling under our control. Savoy needs to be sieged down. You're the one without the siege. You're the one with the siege. Um, does France even have troops? Not really. No, they have a few. No, well, I don't think they have any actually. We're actually going to get the defense as well in the Highlands, so they get a penalty for that. They're actually running away. The bastards. Oh, you bastards! Yeah, let's get stability yet again. Wow, second time we get to the vent with the Diplo guy. Um, France is also here, that's true. But I'm gonna catch you. Even if it's the last thing I'll do. Fini, you can come back home. You can be swapped to Provence. France is not having a great time. Why is that army actually succeeding? Nope, no, we just probably had a few bad rolls in a row. You're now running this way. Yeah, that's complete and utter... What? That is still bullshit. They retreat with that much and then that happens, okay. Yeah, I'm following them around, of course. Oh, they now they've been stack wiped. Okay, um, time for you guys to run home as well. You can go to Alicante then. So, this war is over, and now I need to check the time yet again. Because this stupid thing keeps locking itself. Because it's low in power. No, we'll do the peace deal once Savoy has fallen. Almost 100% down here as well. Loss for yearly prestige. Clemson has embraced the printing press. They already embraced global trade, though. You can go... Wait, what? Something, something New Mexico? <laughs> France, New Mexico. Oh, hello there. Um, we could just steal ourselves a colonial nation, actually, by the way. That would be funny as hell. Just, yeah, you know what? Let's get a colonial nation. Because we can. And that ship is definitely in the wrong zone. We'll go to Valencia. Oh. And Siege of Savoy has fallen. Let's talk with France separately. Sue for peace. Return course to Provence. To Provence. To Provence. That's very freaking expensive though. Let's not do Anjou then, at least. It is, of course, expensive, simply... Be really, that's 39%. Wow. It is very expensive, obviously. Because... I can still take Provence for myself, apparently. Oh, wow, that's actually cheaper. Uh, not, not 
Ghent, I need Provence, I need Avignon. It does cost more aggressive expansion. Only France and the Pope actually care about it. Um, but there is, of course, also the chance to humiliate. And that would actually give us so much power projection for a long time. And this is fine with the aggressive expansion, really. Apparently that's too much, and that's quite enough. It's two provinces, but it's the humiliate that'll do it. And of course, they're not the main target of the war in general anyway, so... Uh, that's quite cheap, actually, getting provinces here. But again, it's the humiliate that I want. Let's say take five of these, get our colonial nation, but no, I don't think it's... It's not something I'm interested in, so I'm gonna send this demand to France. France is out of the war. Provence just grew two sizes. Perfect. And now to call Clemson and just take shit. Like there's no tomorrow. Oh, Morocco would care, barely. That's a nice area we can gain this time around, yeah. Oh yeah, cancel your deal with France while you're... Actually, no, I would like you to keep that alliance for the next time. <laughs> it, would, it would give us a lot of money, though. Let's just do 91 then. There we go, 100% peace deal, and that's a lot of overextension. But, we did lose a lot of men. Not all of them were ours. That gets us the prestige and the manpower recovery. France already into a new war. We have a lot of land to cover and, of course, to convert. Let's just go with... Um, Trapelia is expensive. Hotna is quite cheap in comparison. Oh, and, of course, the good timing is that we have a lot of... Um, and part to quarrel this stuff so yeah why not i would like to thank you all for watching make sure to like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to date in the future i'll see you guys later